Okay, Texas Southern, they just got a big check for playing Rice University and getting smacked around for four quarters. It was 69 nothing until Texas Southern was able to score with 14 seconds left in the game. So, Texas Southern, they got their money. It's going to help the program. It's going to help the athletic department. Texas Southern players, they know what they got to do going forward. They know what level they on as a football team. They're on the FCS, black college football level. Now, Dean Connors, he ran for three touchdowns for Rice University. He had like nine carries for like 100 and something yards. He had his almost 13 yards of carry. Another running back, Taji Atkins, he ran for 90, what, 91 yards on 11 carries. This was a feel-good game for Rice University. It was a money game for Texas Southern University. It went the way it was supposed to go. Texas Southern now, and they'll continue to play swag games, meaningful games, conference games. This game against Rice, everybody knew what this was. And now they'll move on with their season. But I hope that Texas Southern at least got a million five, at least a million five to get whipped on by an FBS program. Hope they got a million five at least. If they ain't get a million five, then what are y'all doing? If y'all ain't get a million one, what are y'all doing? We just saw Northern Illinois get 1.4 million to beat Notre Dame. There's levels to these money games, but the good thing about Texas Southern, they played hard the entire game. Corner Sports Net now. Shout out to Northern Illinois. They got paid $1.4 million to lose to Notre Dame. It was Notre Dame's home opener. But you know what? Northern Illinois said, we don't care about the odds makers. We don't care what Vegas is talking about. We don't. We're going to show up to win. And that's what they did. They beat Notre Dame in South Bend, Indiana. So even though this was a money game, it wasn't like a Division II was playing a Division I, nothing like that. Or some small time college playing an FBS school. Nah, this, this was a legit Division I school playing against a bigger Division I school. There's levels even to money games. There's levels to it. And Northern Illinois is like, look, we play these games on the field. We're going to win. We don't care about no Vegas and odds makers. We don't care about no South Bend, Indiana and, and Notre Dame. And they showed up and they beat Notre Dame. And they pocketed $1.4 million. So that's a double win by Northern Illinois. Now, their coach after the game, he was crying and carrying on. That's cool. Uh, it's a lot of emotion. A lot of football coaches, when they win a big game, they're emotional. That's cool. That's cool. But, uh, yeah, congratulations to Northern Illinois. I mean, Notre Dame is like the Dallas Cowboys of college football. They're on NBC every week, and they're on NBC. Damn, their game of the week. They get so much hype. Notre Dame gets crazy hype. They're independent because they're too good to join a conference. Notre Dame this, Notre Dame that. They get a lot of hype like the Dallas Cowboys. And they don't win big games. So the fact that they lost to Northern Illinois, it don't really even shock me. Because it's Notre Dame. Now, if they could find a way to win nine games, they'll still make the playoffs because they know the name. 